Oh, this is him? The Shrouded Ruins. It's a very good at obscuring things, as long as it's been said to blow boundaries. If we're somehow bringing together the world of humans, the world of Pokemon, and the world of myth, then maybe we need to do something such as this. That being said, what are we meant to do now? It seems I've made it in time. Before I just been reading some of your gifts, did someone see progress across the distance finding us? I had the idea for a rather remarkable Pokemon if you really wish to know. Could you mean that Pokemon that fit its bounded history region? Ah, but never mind it now. What about the red chain? How are we to forge it? I would hardly know. We speak of a divine instrument, one said to be very capable of finding the very world. Do you really imagine it could be formed by mortal hands? Then what are we to do? Such entire vassals of history for the answer? Eh, I don't think so. Ah, the Pokemon of the lakes. The Red Chain. So it was true. The fact that the people have passed down for these generations has been kept. At last, I can set this burden aside. You succeeded once again, Karen. Yet, things do not seem to be going well for the rest of the world. What have you heard now? I read some news from my fellow members in the Ginkgo Guild. See, as Grand was going to for going to for oh for waiting for his case of defense, he plans to climb Mount Coronet himself. Wow, he's really impatient. He has he lost his senses? Let's get closer to Rift to study it himself? Well, he doesn't know that our Karen has managed to get the red chain now, does he? That's true, there's no way he could. We need to tell him about the chain and about Rift to get on us to cheat before he sets out. Bye! Karen? Welcome back! It's been grim here. We and Sophie Cops have hardly ever even speak to one another lately. Once you're back, maybe Captain Sunny's appetite for Tina Mochi will return. Anyway, we're here a minute, will you? I'll go and let the Captain know you're back. Oh, my dear Kaelin! The first of Sophie worried about you, Kaelin. Of course I was worried, but I don't think I could handle hold a candle to just you, sort of Kali. That's going to get out of proportion! I don't think it's appropriate for an adult to make things up just to hide your embarrassment. But, um, where is the captain? Wasn't he coming along with you, Professor? She's very another amount of work, I'm afraid. We're joining her to Sophie Cope's office. It seems her hands are a lot more for, more for now that the Commander Commander is gone. He's not here? Well, we started about going out with the security corps in tow. He's doing hand this whole space time thing with business himself, including dealing with the Pokemon that's been found on the other side. That's why I was spinning in for the regular cards, he's picking you at the ready. Well, we are getting out here, and it's time to sign a report to the captain. So you managed not to die, just as I ordered. Well done. I ordered it, well done. Now that you have passed these on, you have any help you have, may have received. Before moving forward, I must ask. I assume that you're here again because you managed to learn the subject of use. I got this red chain, you see. Go on. A legendary tool said to find the very world. Command Commander is no longer here in Jubilee Village. The security corps had been scouting the area near the space time earth. The report signing has been something on the other side of it. Something that was simple to Pokemon. The commander made a decision to take the security corps to the mountain so as to prepare to fend off any possible threat. They were to make for the temple at the peak. How strong the commander himself may be, he still has gotten Kaelin to help. As the captain of the survey corps, I hereby order you to proceed as follows. Karen, take that red chain to Mount Coronet, make your way to the peak, and put an end to all this. You are officially reinstated at, at your former rank.
Are you certain you can do that with the commando away, Captain? If he didn't wish me to decide things in his place, then he should not have left me in charge here. They're now gone as well. Roar well, is the ghetto. We members of the Soviet Court. Actually, no one suggested you should not. Man, Silas's ancestor has Hi. Oh, <laughs> I can tell what you're the ancestor of. I'm why. <laughs> you even speak. You even have similar lives to him. Well, you see, as much as I'd love to, uh, Proctor Manset. Did you find a commander, Kieran? The commander is already a Mount Cornette. Already? How could a grown man like Commander Commander be so reckless? Just explaining you, Kieran, and now this. I think you need to start talking to. As the leader of the Pearl Clan, Lord the Almighty Sinner who reigns over all space, I can go anywhere in fastest to read that, please. And now I'm going to start to go oh, start to command him. Hmm. Who is the reckless one? Hey, you got one of the village, right? But you still trying to find a way to help us all? Uh, yes. That's right, Kevin worked hard to get that red chain to help us. Too right, and a fine job he did too! So of course, it's always harder work for the sake of everyone here in the village, as well as for the sake of our nations with Pokemon. Thanks! Here, take this! Oh, thank you! Your orders are free. 1. Make for the summit camp, and from there, the Temple of Sinnoh. 2. Use the to solve this mess. And 3. Return here, alive. Merely is there just <laughs> post this probably leering at me. I've heard the latest, so you've been sent back to the gangster team, have you? I suppose congratulations all in order. Here, some max posters for me to celebrate. Thank you, more healing items. Looks like a bit more response than last. But no doubt it'll be fine. After all, you worked so hard to earn that red chain. Most Adam and Oda have ended to speak as well. My good friend, Karen. I was a great fortune in the battles to come. I would truly regret losing one of our most beloved and most loyal customers. Seeing as Commander intends to use the summit camp as a base of operations for his undertaking. As for me, I think I should have close, stop closer to the temple itself. Things certainly seem to have gone out of hand. Well, if anything goes wrong, the game barely will be here for more support at least. Whatever, man. We're heading to the top. And I'm very, very much in dire need of leveling up some of our Pokemon companions, so... Any battles I come across is just gonna be a massive skip in my pass. It basically killed itself. It basically just killed itself. <laughs> well, experience is experience. <coughs> and that's it. Okay, never mind. Ignore, what I, ignore the fact that I need it for the Pokedex or anything. It's good to get for saving so many of these barriers this entire time. 
the stone. That's not important. This electrifier is not giving me any sort of comfort. Stone portal. I don't know how to let anyone pass. I don't really know what the point is any longer, dude. Do you think you ask me? <laughs> He's just giving up the world to be a god. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, still alive and kicking. Sorry about having just suddenly a wallflower. It wasn't about to be hit there now, serving up some physical and but pretend mochi. But that task my master comrade has gone, let's be to oversee our food supply. He always finds a way to put even those old bones to work. Well, I'm handling that, I'm supposed to handle you as well. Now we go with you once and for all. Are you serious? I'm making myself plain. As comrade's right hand, I'm charged as executing all the gritty deeds that comrade can't or won't do himself. I give him my word, I give it of any force that might dream of getting in the way of his plans. And besides, it's not just Commodore who longs to live in a home for your fearless your life. His dream is mine now, too. Oh. Huh. Now I'm even more confused as to who you're. you're the... Are you even a original? Are you an original character, or are you an ancestor or somebody? I'm. I'm not sure. Oh boy, Miss Magius. Oh then? How about I get a taste of good old painful fox? You used an item. Set up a sand one. <laughs> Who would have think the person that shot it that left us out the third put the person we actively spoke to was the one who be all who were hateful against us to begin with. <laughs> Turns out he was evil all along. Who would have thought? Thanks for killing yourself as well, fine, I guess. You all. Wow, that was rude. I'm afraid he can- oh, never mind. Oh, well, it's okay, it's a good thing I got a gun for my own to stall! For time! I'm Bot Fairy too, you know. And I can also stall him. I think he's done that. Hey, Fairy. Oh, blasted! Oh, 
Ah, that sneeze was just so pathetic. Doesn't have that in your freaking quick attack, it's just so rude. Why well, you gotta be so rude? Uh, the boys go ahead and just make stuff use for be. Be able to be sacrificed, I guess. He's won't even gave me his annual speed times. When I effectively want the hunting to actually just go stress, no. It's the yeah, of course the go stress. Makes me waste my time to find a five more Pokemon for experience. Especially when it comes to top boys. So honestly, that game super seems coming. Oh no, perhaps I should have seen that coming. Man, if one of you had something that's immune to fighting types here. Better Rude! Why is that now gonna go first? Heck off game. That is an off. Since my ninja tactics is to be consigned to history. Oh look, all that experience would have been a good use to everybody else. If they were alive. Very good, young one, and very good indeed. This is only a foolish, a foolish ninja who tries to keep after a target they know they cannot beat. And to be honest, I don't hate you. I might actually like you after a fashion. At least for the skill you show in battle. But listen well, Kieran, Pokemon are truly terrifying creatures. Cardinal and Sai saw our hometown burned to the ground by mad Pokemon running a mark. We lost plenty of friends in combat today. I tried Cardinal came here to Sui to try and build a new home where people could live free from fear. But to achieve something truly great, you sometimes have to take extreme actions. If, hypothetical as may be, a Pokemon would appear from within that space time rift, Cardinal might lo lose hold of his reason. Save Cardinal from himself, by force if you must. Do that, and I'll stuff you full of wordless and spitting more than a human stomach can handle. Okay. Oh, yeah. My Pokemon was torn on screen. Okay. Why don't I take that? I'm going to stop you, Commodo. Nothing you can do or say will stop me. Well, this is it. Have you bought everything you need? I don't know if I'm even gonna have enough to have to sell, to be honest. Even I don't think I need most of these things here. I can always just get these from the time distortions. I guess I might as well just sell. As much as well sell as much as I need for any more mass preparations. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and get four maxifies. And I don't know, two more hyperposons. 
Not much I can do here other than let's just hope for the best. There he is. I see him back there. You better take it that way to go to the top of the mountain. That Pokemon's starting to stand on the big moment now. I think maybe Almighty Sinnoh. now. But all this has to be started, and you're the only one who can do it. Almighty oh, Sinnoh says we're nearly here, but the, the commander obstructs us. You again. I've heard that this great chain of yours will bind the world. I assume that to bind the world means to hold the world together, keeping it as it's meant to be. A welcome idea, but can I truly put my face in such tales? Trust me. Commander, please, be reasonable. I understand that you're bound to protect your people as the commander of the Galaxy Expedition team. I have to think duty toward my clan. But down a camera like this, you're not a swung. You're a fool! Perhaps you're all right. But if I were to simply face my face at this boy and that face would be betrayed, then how can I possibly face my people? <coughs> you may think you're the only one desperate to protect the people of Jubilife, but you're not! Karen is putting his life on the line as well! Fine! Enough! Let fate decide what happens next. Whichever of us is stronger will prevail. Face me with a Pokemon, Karen. Today, we battle win in earnest. Hey, it's a good thing I have a ghost type out, huh? Balance. Oh, you sucker. That's my wing. Oh boy. Ow. Okay, that's a screw. You have better speed than me. How dare you? Bob wants that sucker. But it was uh. Whatever. I guess it didn't actually do it on the freaking agile style. That's my mistake then. Come on. At least your defense is lower, but that's still not going to be enough because you're going to agile dying me to death. Game's giving me time to actually revive Pokemon. Oh, 
I'll go ahead and take the opportunity to do so. But I'm going to need a heal after this attack. Or not, because this is probably going to kill me. As I predicted, as it normally does. Yeah, yeah, still fuck me, never. I can just do this to you normally, this is fine. Oh man. If phone the game would actually give me an opportunity to actually go for this, it does not need to do it every freaking time. The game obscured. I was heck off. Any Pokemon that spends a life here must be eliminated. You truly are forced to be back at this. Kewan, the fates have decided. I concede, and I apologize sincerely for doubting you. Commander Komodo. I know I have no way to ask you if you any longer, but please, use that face of yours for the sake of the galaxy and the team. No, for the sake of the Celestica people and all the pe Pokemon living in the Sui. Don't you worry, Commander. You've got the red chain. <laughs> 